518 now on today's TMJ4. And let's get a check of your weather and traffic together. Let's go over to Brian Goddard to start things off. Okay, Brian? so I, we asked this question at weather uh, school talks and at weather day. So I want to ask the two of you, why is hurricane season start on June 1st? Because that's when the storms start. I don't know. <laughs> Convenient bookkeeping. <laughs> Convenient bookkeeping. I like both of those answers. Uh, the water temperature of the Atlantic and the Gulf have to be 80 degrees. Oh. And that's the stretch from. No, and always on June 1st, it's 80 degrees well, no matter always, what. Always, but we'll see you then. See? Convenient bookkeeping. Yeah. <laughs> from June until right. November, that's when the water is 80. Hurricanes do not like cold uh, temperatures, uh, cold water, I should say. That's why you never hear of a hurricane hitting uh, California because the water temperature there is in the 50s and 60s. See? So there you go. I'm done. Back to you guys. <laughs> uh, rain showers this morning still around uh, parts of Fond du Lac, Sheboygan, Washington County, and then just fizzling out. Look at all the rain that was on this radar, and it's just falling apart. It's not fair. It happened yesterday as well. Some folks got quite a bit of rain. Others, just a few drops of rain. So right now, Hartford's seeing a little moderate rain. Uh, now moving into uh, the West Bend area, just north of Richfield, along 45 and 41 there as well. You can see downtown West Bend. Uh, the roads are wet, and the temperature is 61 degrees. The wind is calm, humidity at 94 percent, so a little dampness in the air. Weather headlines after these morning rain showers will be clearing and warm today, which is a spotty afternoon shower developing. The pick day looks to be tomorrow and Friday looks to be nice as well. And then rain showers return for Saturday. Still sniffling and sneezing, and that's because now grasses have decided to get into the game. Uh, very high trees still high and the mold down to moderate just when things are bad enough. The grass decides to get into the party. It's not nice. 60 in West Dallas, 59 in South Milwaukee, and 58 in Glendale up in Sheboygan County. You are seeing some scattered rain showers in Howard Grove, Elkhart Lake, Plymouth, and Greenbush. Uh, down towards Random Lake, a few sprinkles and 57 degrees. So we're still seeing a few scattered rain showers on the future forecast around 830. I think this is overdoing it. You're definitely going to see some rain showers around, uh, and then things will start to really calm down throughout the afternoon. But with the heating and a little bit of humidity in the air, we will get a stray shower popping up. Up with that afternoon heat. Dew points are in the 50s to 60s, but look at the dry air off to the west. That's here by tomorrow. Temperatures today will be in the upper 70s to around 80 degrees, except for right along the lakefront. That southerly wind will keep wind point cool. Also, Sogville, Port Washington, and downtown Sheboygan. As I mentioned, the dew points will be dropping starting tomorrow. It'll be comfortable Thursday, Friday. Saturday jumps up just a little bit with the rain and then cools down once again, or dries out, I should say, uh, for Sunday. Once we get the rain showers out of here this morning and just a few this afternoon, tomorrow and most of Friday look to be fantastic. Here's your seven day forecast. 77 with some afternoon clearing today and just a slight chance of an afternoon pop up shower. Thursday is sunny all day, just a few clouds in the afternoon, 74, 75 on Friday, rainy on Saturday, and just a few showers, windy and cooler on Sunday. Tatiana. All right, good morning.